wants to ruin Jared's life. Uh, okay. me! 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 I do, me, 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 me. I already me. think he did it to himself. Oh, all right, well. Uh, Thanks a lot, Jake. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I, it's not. This is not the sole purpose. I just know that this is going to ruin your life. Thank you. That it's breaking news. I can guess, but I'm not gonna. I don't want to get. I know it. It's got to be because I know the one passion he has with fast food. But go ahead. Okay. The breaking news from the fast food world is that McDonald's is getting rid of their free yeah. drink refills. I knew it. I will what? never go there again. <laughs> what? I will never go there again. I knew it. What? I mean, I'll go through the drive-thru, but I'll what? never go it's again. It's a dollar for a big big cup, though. Yeah. I will never go there. I will not go there. Uh, I will not go. you'll pay $3 for free refill somebody else. I will not go dine in somewhere. No, I'll go to another fast food place that's a dollar well, or a dollar fifty. The nobody. bad news here, Jared, is that a business expert who studies this sort of thing says, and this is a direct quote, McDonald's tends to be the leader in the industry. Very often when McDonald's yeah. makes changes, other restaurants follow suit. McDonald's is very smart about their costs. So they believe that once this begins with McDonald's, the, the no more, they're saying no more uh -huh. to free drink refills, it will become the norm for everybody else. Nope. Mm. Well, I will say this. Better not. The one thing that McDonald's has, and it, I think they're already tricking, uh, tricking Jared, is most other restaurants are like almost three dollars now for a soda yeah. that you get free refills. Mm -hmm. But McDonald's is one dollar or something. It used to be one dollar, and you can get a big cup for one dollar. Mm -hmm. So ultimately, if you got two of those, it's way more and still cheaper than the place that has free refills. Yeah. If I were any other fast food place, I would like call out McDonald's for being cheap and mm -hmm. like well, look what they're doing. Yeah, but they can't yeah. because they're already free more refills. expensive on their drinks. No, but. The fact that it's it's the branding though it's the saying yeah. McDonald's going to charge you per refill mm -hmm. a dollar this this day and time they might change that you don't know uh, they probably I heard, but I also heard they're going to go to they're they're coming up with a five dollar meal because yes. their sales are way down the problem with the and I can tell you that too this also might break your heart and those who love the five dollar meal that's coming to McDonald's it's only for the summer it's oh, not going to last they're testing yeah, it. yeah people you know are what it upset. is. Um, no, but I think that they they are kind of going after the five dollar piggy Wendy's. bag. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, but where you get because they, they said the four dollar or the sorry the five dollar uh, meal from McDonald's is going to contain four items, which is exactly what the biggie bag at Wendy's Looks does. Looks like Wendy's is the leader. So we, I don't know. Well, Wendy's was thinking about doing that whole AI certain times and raising mm -hmm. the prices, and and Wendy's might be more expensive overall. I Wendy, think I, it, it is. is. Yeah. I mean, now mm. if you don't go somewhere to get a special, like you know, some I think Taco Bell has a box, Wendy's has this mm -hmm. a certain thing, uh, then it's expensive. I mean, combos now is not unusual to see a fast food combo over ten dollars, yep. yeah, yep. which is insane. But, and that is not necessarily the fault of the restaurant. No, it's everything's more expensive. For yeah. their costs have gone up too, and everything has gone up, and they have to pay their employees more, so mm -hmm. that gets reflected. Um, mm -hmm. I did hear that uh, you know when you had those. Uh, you know the those celebrities like Travis Scott did the the combo meal. Oh yeah, the, now, the meal now, specials. Now uh, Mr. Beast has a combo meal that's coming out with Whoa. Zaxby's. Uh, oh, oh, my my kids okay. love Zaxby's. Love Zaxby's. Yes, I just took my yeah. kids for the very first time. They ask me, really? Especially Eli every day. Yeah. Go to Zaxby's. I'm like, there's not yeah. one close I think to our it's house. because yeah. Mr. Beast. It was before it, that. Oh, We've really? been like yeah, the last year. My kids yeah. didn't know. Two years, well, I think yeah. Mr. Beast like always liked Zaxby's. You know. Oh, that's true. Yeah. It, it, my son loves Mr. Beast, so that wouldn't be a far stretch. But he, they like. A specific. I want to eat this sp specific thing. It's mm -hmm. my favorite. It is chicken. good. It's my favorite. When chicken. I eat it, it's delicious. Mm -hmm. yeah. I just they don't have, uh, do it very sauce. often. Apparently, it comes with you know a couple sauces and whatever it is. But it also comes with a Texas toast. Choc Texas toast. Uh -huh. Yeah, it does. How do you know that? Because I eat it Zaxby's. all the time. <laughs> uh, uh, okay, Texas toast, and also it comes with like a milk chocolate bar that I think it's Mr. Beast. Oh, his his um feastables. Yeah, feastables. Is that what yeah. It is? Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. uh, all I hear. Is it healthier than a Although, no. no, I spent $50 yes. on to get like he 10 says, chocolate bars. It's he said that the chocolate bars have better and uh, better ingredients. In of course, it. that's what he says. But it's I his. know that that prime stuff, uh, apparently there's some lawsuits about it. Yeah. Not, not healthy. Well, I don't think, does he make prime or he just he's drank prime? He with just it. endorsed it. I thought it was Jake Paul. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. Jake yeah, Paul. I, I was going to say, I don't think yeah, he's Jake Paul. bad. But the Feastables, God. My kids are Henry mostly obsessed, and of course he says the same thing, which are just the talking points of like, oh, it's it's even better than Hershey's. I'm like, who's no, more it isn't. successful, Jake Paul or Mr. Mr. Beast? Mr. Beast. Mm. Okay. Well, I don't. I mean, I don't the thing about Mr. Beast is he reinvests. I listened to a long thing mm -hmm. interview with him, like three hour interview with him. He reinvests everything. 
And even the people interviewing him, like, if you didn't do that, you'd be worth like $300 million. So I think Jake Paul is worth more. But overall, like, uh, footprint as far as online is. But and they're and both, charitable they're both giving. And charitable and giving, yes. 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 Like, he's giving away like 25 Teslas and mm-hmm. Squid and, and other people around the station crap on me for my Tesla. <laughs> And they're the first ones to I come in. I want one. On I want well, one. Because that one that they win would be oh. brand new. True. Oh, yeah, yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And free. I guess you're right. You've never made fun of it. That's true. Yeah, yeah but the uh, it says according to Google, uh, Mr. Beast's worth worth is net worth is about 100 million, and Jake Paul's is about 38. Oh, okay. Poor. Huh. I yeah. feel bad for him. A poor. Well, after he gets uh, his head knocked off by Mike Tyson, it'll be a lot more. Yeah, well, there's yeah. that. And the reason that that ruins, just in case you're wondering, you're like, how does that ruin Jared's life? It's oh, because yes. Jared drinks about. 30 refills of soda every time we go to lunch. Yes, I And that's do. just when we're with him. He makes up the difference in the lack of coffee and alcohol <laughs> and soda. <laughs> and soda. And I did in hear one it, it is my crush. The yeah. number one beverage in the United States for adults. The number one beverage that's consumed the most is not tap water or bottled water. Diet Coke. Coffee. Oh. Oh, yeah, I believe I that. that. That's yeah. crazy, yeah. though. Yeah. I could the, see it. A lot of people drink water. It seems like with your... Stanley Cups that well yeah I mean, your coffee has yeah. water in it right mm-hmm. yeah but that's not they're not considering that right oh, they're making it but coffee and yeah. other things with caffeine are addictive so mm-hmm. that makes mm-hmm. more sense water is not addictive and drinking a lot of water is kind of bland yeah, it is just plain I think, water I think yeah. it is addictive difficult. eventually eventually you get Cause, there because your body like craves a certain amount mm-hmm. of water and eventually you're always wanting water and but mm-hmm. your mouth gets dry I, it is mm-hmm. that is a truth i have been there when i'm exercising but, i yeah. can i would only want water mm-hmm. well, i need not even gatorade i just want water i don't want things mixed mm-hmm. in it i just want water but mm-hmm. right. that doesn't happen very often well yeah <laughs> <laughs> it needs to happen more yeah. for sure <laughs> it should be happening more i don't think mistake by mcdonald's obviously they're smart they do a lot of research but some things don't work mm-hmm. i think charge people for refills people are, yeah, even I, if it's just a dollar i think people are going to be like uh-uh yeah. the only way that they're going to be able to enforce it and i do think that by the year 2032 mcdonald's was trying to take out which sounds so far away but really it's not uh mcdonald's was trying to take out all of the self-serve uh machines, machines. please yeah. do yeah, that's been a disaster yeah. and so then Why? you have to go to the front no, because it, it takes it takes bre- forever really work. Mm-hmm. it takes for Oh, the, mm-hmm. I, I thought you meant the self-service soda machine. No. Yes, the self-service oh, soda machine. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought you were talking about the, the kiosk. Yeah. Those things are slow. Oh, yeah, no. Even my kids who are quick, made quicker than that, it takes mm-hmm. forever. And then usually you have to go back up to the counter and be like, no, I didn't order that. Ugh. And I can never figure out how to pull up all of the- um, You don't have everything. Like the deals. Mm-hmm. No, they're you know, trying to take out the soda fountain. The soda uh, machine. Okay. Yeah. This country. I hope, I hope. But that thing takes forever sometimes because oh, really? then it's like, uh, yeah, because it's out of ice. Or then yeah. you have to like go through every single option. I'm I prefer, I'm paying for to go yeah, in there. If, you know what I mean? Jared's fifteen refills. He's got to wait in line, go get an employee. Well, but he, he could just yeah. get up there quick and hit the ice, hit the coat. That's the way that they're going to be able to control it. Yeah, the one thing I don't, I think in theory, and I know Wendy's and Zaxby's have it, is those one, the the soda machines that have like 150 options. Yes, mm-hmm. yeah, that's a disaster. That, yes, that, that thank is, you. That's what more you, complicated. Yeah. yeah, in theory, it's like this is great, tons of choices. You get somebody up there, and I've been guilty. Usually, mm-hmm. I know what I'm getting. It takes but forever. They're like, oh, there's. Seven different types of Sprite? I didn't yeah. know that. What about Fanta? Let and me taste like, this one. Yeah, and you're like, oh, my gosh. Right. Or then one of the components isn't working, that's and then you say, I want vanilla Coke, but then the vanilla's out. Uh, yeah, that's right. just relatable to Katie when the bar is really busy. We're like, oh, we need another beer. <laughs> uh, that's how Jared is. <laughs> yeah, no, when they have to change <laughs> yeah. the kegs, I'm like, oh, uh, I'll just I'll have another one on tap. Yeah. Oh. Well, yeah, I don't like it, but I'll take it. <laughs> of course. That's like Jared saying, oh, great, I'm going to have to change it <laughs> to a different soda. <laughs> it's so true. Every time I pick a beer, they're like, oh, it, we just blew this keg. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right.